Good day, collective. I'm here with some quick spiritual warfare messages for the weekend. This is for my divine feminines and my divine masculines that have Capricorn as their sun sign. Okay. You can be the Capricorn. This could be the Capricorn, uh, Capricorn working against you. Just take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Personal spiritual warfare messages um, are available. The description box has the links for personal readings. Also, weekly overall bundles of readings is available for $30. Pick a day out the week that you want to get your message. And it will be delivered to you weekly, same day of the week for $30. That's me. Okay? All right. Universe, what's the spiritual warfare messages for my sun signs in Capricorn? Divine masculines or feminine? Divine masculines and feminine, okay? Just for the whole gang gang. Divine masculine and divine feminine on my channel. Divine masculines is males. Divine feminines are females. You can put it how it resonates with you, all right? What's the spiritual warfare messages today? What is my collective with sun signs and Capricorn most need to know? Divine masculines and divine feminists. All right. So listen, you guys. You currently have people. We'll find out who. Spiritually attacking you. They're using different mechanisms to create um, obstacles to distract you from your priorities. Okay. Basically, fuck with your thought process. So you manifest things that it's not of your higher good, of your higher self, and can distract you from your actual awakenings and ascensions and getting downloads from the universe, all right? You'll have some unnecessary um, external circumstances like irrelevant as people reaching out to you or some circumstances. You might start feeling some type of way at work out of no reason. Make sure you're clearing your heart chakra as well. Your ancestors want you to clear your heart chakra so that your finances can be in good standing. What else does Sun Sign and Capricorn? Sun Sign and Capricorn, Divine Masculines and Divine Feminines need to know. Sun Sign and Capricorn. Who's doing all these attacks? Like, as far as the spiritual attacks, mm, as far as the spiritual attacks, and using multiple mechanisms, you guys have somebody that's that's low vibrational. It could be an ex or somebody that you turned, you know, turned um, got turned off by in the past, and they just talking so much shit about you with their mouth that is basically creating a Gregor's to create blockages and delays in your life. So you got an ex, and you got somebody that's just low vibrational. North Node and Capricorn. All right. Maybe it's somebody you met at work as a customer, or again, somebody that you used to actually, you know, flirt with or be a lover, or say you have a new lover now. Somebody might see you flirting with somebody online and decides to just create a bunch of muckery because that's what it feels like it is. Okay. So let's see. Universe, what is North Node and Capricorn? Up, oh, not North Node. Sun sign. Sun sign and Capricorn. So it's a North Node and Capricorn watching. Hey, how you doing today? What is my Sun sign and Capricorn? Sun sign and Capricorn. What do they need to know about spiritual warfare? The North Node and Capricorn watching is currently delusional as fuck because they poor hustling and also in the Five of Pentacles. I ain't going to say I'm sorry about that. You just never saw this shit coming. You shouldn't be out here spiritually attacking people and putting stuff in people drinks and shit. That's for the North Node and Capricorn watching. Universe, what is my sun sign? To Thank you. Walk away from external people and circumstances, my divine feminine and divine masculine Capricorns. When you can see that somebody is deliberately trying to distract you from your priorities, walk away from that person. Okay? All right. What does my uh, sun sign and Capricorn divine masculines and divine feminines most need to know when it comes to these uh, spiritual attacks? What's 
my Capricorn sun signs, divine feminines and divine masculines need to know the spiritual warfare. Thank you. It's going to be a will of fortune, destiny, fate. So whoever's talking all this stuff and wanting to attack you possibly could be working. Like I said, you might have met this person at work. Whatever it is you do, you came across this person or these people during a job of some sort. Yeah, because you got money and they know you have, have, have love, new love and new relationships coming, Capricorn. And they, they don't want it to never end. It seems like it just began. Let that shit go. They over there in the five of cups. Okay. Don't. And then with the six of cups in reverse right here. Listen. Divine masculines and divine feminines. Listen to me. Use your intuition. All right. Use your intuition. Spiritually. Spiritually. Some things are going to happen that you didn't see coming. But it will be positive things for your awakening. Let me see about some signs here. Let us see. Let me remember where I put that deck. Universe, where did I put my deck with the signs? Where did I put that deck with the signs? Here we go. Sorry about that. Sun signs and Capricorn, divine masculines and divine feminines. What signs? What signs is spiritually attacking my collective that have Capricorn as their sun sign? What signs is this? What signs is deliberately trying to create obstacles when my collective is going to walk away and accept their own destiny and fate and let the tables turn? All right, so we got Neptune. Uh, give me a second. This just lets me know it's Neptunians, okay? With 21 on there, which is the world card. All right, so it could be multiple people, not just one person. It's a Pisces. Yep, it's a Pisces. So Capricorn Collective, there is a Pisces that you need to walk away from because they're trying to deliberately distract you from your priorities, okay? And they're spiritually attacking you because the tables have turned on them, all right? 